Hey, you forgot your gun. You're not gonna leave it behind, are you? You see, with my leg being a bit tender and all, I would rather not have the extra weight in my belt. You're not gun shy after the last training exercises, are you? Gentlemen, this is a fast fire exercise. Herman, you're up first. bad enough, but it's the article in the prospector that really vexes me. You can't go out on duty without your sidearm. Why don't we just go out and take a few shots and get your confidence back. Take a few shots. 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 
No one will know. My commanding presence is all I need to keep the peace. Still walking it off, eh? <laughs> so you're the feller that went and shot himself in the leg. <laughs> Folks around here, they're saying they could hear you hollering like a baby from the other side of town. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <man>. <laughs> what a moron. Yeah. <laughs> Buffoon. Mrs. Maverick is coming with a fresh batch of muffins. Muffins! Muffins! Oh, oh. like Mr. Stockmore not to be in shop on a Tuesday. Mr. Stockmore is... is out. And I told him that I would watch over the place and see to it that everything was looked after. I'll just leave these here with you. But mind that nobody takes off with all of them. People are always after my award-ridden recipe. Doubtless your baking is in high demand. You don't know the half of it. So I've stowed it safely in a secret place where nobody can find it. Well, I'd best be going. Excellent. Keep an eye on my basket. Of course. <laughs> you had no idea what was coming. <laughs> these won first prize in the fall fair. Mrs. Maverick placed these on the wrong table, so she won first place in women's woodworking, being the only woman who entered in that particular category. What was in that? I suppose it was whatever was decaying in the icebox. <coughs> Where's your gun? Don't tell me you're not carrying that thing around with you anymore. <laughs> Still gun shy or have you lost your privileges? <laughs> That's quite enough. Mention it again. Oh, and you'll what? Shoot us in the leg? <laughs> <laughs> Hop along there, Corporal. <laughs> I think I've got some cream for that. <laughs> Good day, Limpy. Don't call me that. Uh, still a little tender, eh? <laughs> My leg will be fine. My reputation, on the other hand, is another matter entirely. How can I maintain law and order when no one takes me seriously, I'll never live this down. The article in the prospector, 
ruined me. I've dedicated my life to the enforcement of the law. This is what I do best, ensuring that the law is upheld underneath my watchful eye. Just need a chance to prove it. Shouldn't you be in your cell? <laughs> the judge gave me leave. If I can collect a bail of $50, I can walk free and skip the community service entirely. Good day, Cletus. I need to borrow $50. Don't you go looking at me. I lost all my money last night at the Windsor. $50? You'd have to rub me blind to get that kind of money. You're out of your mind, Arnold. Don't you go getting any ideas, Arnold. Somebody noticed, eh? It doesn't have to be this way. I do know what I'm talking about here. You know, the secret to good shooting is to find a target that you really hate. Yes? Any... Muffins left by any chance? Arnold, I can see your ankles. <laughs> that lady had hairy legs. Oh, I don't fancy that myself. Take a deep breath. Focus on those muffins. Good to be back. 
it's time to try the tin can. There's nothing we can do. Not the barn, the recipe! People are always after my award-winning recipe. So I've stowed it safely in a secret place. You know, you know the secret, secret to good shooting is to find a target, find a target, target, target that you really that hate. Really hate. Quite right. <laughs> Safe hasn't locked in years. That's why I don't keep anything of any value in there. I tend to keep things of value scattered around the shop. It makes it easier for me. For instance, uh, this can, I believe. Uh, yes, it has the money that I made last week. I gotta put that in the bank soon. Uh, over here, uh, yeah, I've got some valuables that I've been keeping for quite a while. And my trusty hat, yep. I'll just keep a couple hundred in there just in case. Oh, Arnold. Even though a significant jail time would be highly justified, the court has ruled for a lighter sentence. You, young man, will begin fixing Mrs. Maverick's barn immediately as an act of community service. I'll take the jail time. That is entirely out of the question. Arnold, my lad, don't you be a worrying. I'll bring you my wood, wood and muffins every day till the day you die, son. Every day. I'll take the jail time. I'll take the firing squad. The, the guillotine. We haven't had a good hanging in a while. How about a hanging? Hey, how about a hanging? Oh, come on, Herman. I thought we were pals. You didn't empty my bucket!
I took you long enough. I know. Glad it's over. Ah. That's enough community service for one day. Did you use nails? Yes, I used nails. You wouldn't believe the dream I had last night. There was bandits and sunsets and flamingos. I just need a chance to prove it. Nice hat. Thanks. Okay, what are our lines for this? <laughs> nice work, dude. <laughs> Thank you. Hello. <laughs> we're, we're now, Gun legs, McGee. 